Hi, welcome all of you on platform of your PD education and you are watching the videos related to uh, statement of purpose, st research proposals, how to write it for different departments. So you will find many videos in the playlist related to SOPs, SORs, LORs for different departments for different courses. Let me tell you first that uh, uh, SOPs and SORs are uh, basically asked for different higher education courses like MS and PhD and even for mtech courses uh, to name a few like rural technology departments you know like uh, iit guwahati iit bombay satara department they ask for M uh, sop even for mtech and it is uh, uh, normally asked for ms and phd courses and students have confusion about sop sor also you can watch detailed videos on your pedia uh, mentioning the difference between sop sor but let me tell you very briefly SOP is nothing but uh, why you want to do MS, why you want to do PhD, what is the reason and a research proposal which is also called research statement or SOR that is what you want to do in that. Normally IITs mein wo SOR hi mangta hai, they ask you for SOR in which you will write something about SOP also. So SOP, SOR is the same document for IITs, it is one page document in which first paragraph will be about you and then uh, you know from where you got this interest for MS course or PhD course in particular field and then you will refer something about what you want to do maybe you will make a link between your BTEC project and uh, the uh, MS or PhD which you want to do you will mention something about the department of that IIT in which you want to pursue this course so this is how your research proposal should proceed forward you know your research proposal should have innovative and creative component in that so do not copy paste your PDA is providing you these SOPs but don't copy paste because you will be caught and that will not be good you will be rejected after that so just uh, uh, develop the idea how to make it make a really good research proposal and if you want to take the help of uh, mentors of your PDA you can do that also so you can send that uh, document to us we will correct it and uh, also not only correct but uh, mentors will also guide you how the question will be framed based upon your SOP in your interviews so let's go this particular video is uh, related to uh, one of the MS program in aerospace department of IIT Bombay so IIT Bombay aerospace uh, program uh, asked for the research proposal so let me now discuss with you what kind of uh, proposal we should make first paragraph you are telling that uh, why you want to do uh, aerospace ms why you want to go in this particular direction what is the reason so why you uh, decided at the first place to go for this particular department and uh, why you decided to go for specialization in aerospace engineering that is your own interest why you are interested in aerospace that is the first paragraph second is that uh, when i was doing my graduation or something like that i developed my interest in this so this is also extension of the first paragraph that you attended some kind of presentation fly by wire and then that gave you motivation and then you saw the institutes like isro hal and the tejas atam nirbhar bharat rafal of drd so you are telling why you got interested in aerospace uh, uh, department and then you uh, mention about your own learning dynamics and control that is a part of your curriculum and uh, uh, in this domain you would like to go in aerospace as you know aerospace is interdisciplinary department that means uh, civil engineers mechanical engineers electronic electrical engineers all can join this department now there are different domains of aerospace department like you know uh, structures is there propulsion is there then dynamics and control is there so electronics electrical people join dynamics and control department in that you will also say that okay i did nptel course on sensors and actuators and from there i got interested in this and uh, then you will mention you know the work which you have done so you did some course of professor hardik of isc and then you learned a couple of things and then your btech project was also related to this so you will you will tell that why you got interested in this field btech project btech course whatever you have done so that is the reason and then why iit bombay so aerospace department iit bombay you need to see that department and you need to see what work is going on in that department then you will say okay this is a very prestigious department and if i get the opportunity here uh, i will pursue my research here so you may mention some research work of some professor like ashok joshi he has done work in this domain so i've seen his work and i'm interested in his work so that kind of thing you can add it up 
so then at the end you will uh, leave the couple of lines like if i get the opportunity i will be pursuing uh, my research in domain of aerospace engineering this is what we want to do so from where you got interested in this what you have done so far in related to this field like he mentioned about nptel course and then if you join iit iit bombay why iit bombay sir very good research facilities this lab is very good this professor is doing good work and what you want to do in that sir if i join i will be working further in this direction this is all about one page sop this is how you have to make it so prepare well uh, write your own sop there should be innovative so it is not that if i give you this sop you will copy paste it and give it it, is, it should not be like that he is going to ask you questions related to your research proposal so there has to be some component of individuality i mean you should be reflected in your sop it is not that uh, you can give somebody's sop because you will be missing in that sop right so it has to be your sop so you have to make it as per your requirement as per your background you just do it and that is how you have to proceed forward hope you got benefited with this uh, watch all the sops which are relevant to your domain of learning thank you Thank <laughs> you.